located in the North Chicago suburb of Evanston, Illinois, and strategically placed right next to Ryan Field Football Stadium, home of the Northwestern Wildcats, is Mustard's last stand. They've been here since 1968 and haven't renovated since. With low ceilings and countertop only dining, unless you're brave enough to sit outside during winter, this place has all the Chicago favorites. But I'm here to try just four things. The Polish sausage, the bratwurst, the Chicago dog, and the Italian sausage. First up is the Polish sausage, and even though they have signs directly telling me they use Vienna beef, I could tell just by looks alone. Grilled to perfection and fully loaded with tomato slices, mustard, diced onions, relish, a pickle spear, a sprinkle of celery salt, sports peppers, and all served on a poppy seed bun. It looks amazing! And the taste? Incredible. This one guy working the grill knows what he's doing. The flavors are a whirlwind, everything hitting you all at once and yet easily distinguishable. The sourness of the mustard and pickles do a balancing act with the sweetness of the relish and onions, complementing the savoriness and saltiness of the Polish sausage. Nine and a half out of ten. Moving on to the bratwurst, which is actually an item we don't see too many from restaurants around here. It's simple enough. A gray log served with mustard diced onions and of course sauerkraut. It may not look like much, but in this case, looks are deceiving because this bratwurst is huge on flavor. The brat alone is tailgate worthy, but the sauerkraut they use sends it over the top. Tastes like game day. Nine out of ten. Now it's time for the staple of Chicago cuisine, the hot dog. And even though this is also a Vienna beef hot dog, for some reason, it just doesn't hit the same as that Polish sausage. It's got the same toppings, but the hot dog wasn't nearly as flavorful. It could be that by the time I got around to eating it, it cooled off quite a bit. Or it could be that my taste buds were already worn out from the previous two heavy hitters. The hot dog taste just seems diminished. 7 out of 10. And lastly is the Italian sausage, which of course we got dipped in beef oil and smothered in hot pepper mix. Spiced right, girthy, and complemented by the heat and crunch of the pepper mix. It's pretty stellar. It is noticeably less juicy than the Polish, which is amazing since it was dipped and it was a little on the salty side. But it still packs a huge flavor and will leave you wanting more, even though you just ate two sausages and a hot dog. A solid sausage. Eight out of 10. In summation, Mustard's Last Stand delivers on the goods. A place to grab a quick bite to eat and catch the big game? Or more realistically, a place to grab a quick bite to eat and then race home to demolish your toilet. Impressive work regardless. Bo -bo 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 -bo